It's another summer in the city when the days are just so hot you have to get in the water. When you simply can't get to the beach, I love creating a serene escape somewhere in my home where I can imagine the waves soothing away my stress. This place for me is my beachy bathroom. Today we're going to add some more seaside elements, starting with giving this lamp a nautical revamp. In a little bit, I'm going to wrap the base of my lamp with this thick boat rope. But first, I'm going to go ahead and paint my lampshade. And I'm going to use this painter's tape to create some nice stripes. First, I'm going to use the seam of the lampshade to put the first piece of tape on to be my guide to make sure that they're all straight. Without tearing the tape, I'm going to pull it over across to the other side of the lamp. Now that my tape is evenly spaced for my stripes, I'm gonna go ahead and cut out this center piece and then douse the whole thing in Mod Podge so my paint won't bleed. I'm going to use a smaller twine to stabilize a larger rope as I wrap it around the base of the lamp. Start by positioning the center points of four long pieces of twine under the first wrap of rope. As you wrap, use the tails of the twine to tie an overhand knot around the rope. Use square knots at the beginning and end of the process to make it easier, and you may want to ask a friend to help to keep the rope tight. I really like how the twine worked out. At first I thought I was going to use hot glue, but this turned out to be a great way to secure the rope. To finish the base, I'm going to double knot all of the small pieces of twine and then cut off the excess piece of large rope and then tuck it right on in there. Now I'm going to carefully take off my painter's tape to reveal my stripes. Yay! Sweet! I love how the lamp turned out. It really transforms the whole room to be a beachy escape. A few other elements that I added are this really radical sea urchin that I made. I blew up some photos of our honeymoon and a really cool trip that we took to Maine. I reupholstered the chair with a vintage Swedish nautical print fabric on it. I also fashioned this nautical knot belt that I made out of rope. Let me know in a comment below which of those projects you'd like to see in a video tutorial. The beach and the water are what speak to me, but find whatever brings you calm and peace and bring a little bit of that into your home. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.